right, another week in the book. Solid training week overall. Things are getting a little bit cold, though. You'll see some hoodies and maybe even some pants in this video. And you guys know I don't really care for pants, but that's a whole other story. Uh, what we're doing and switching in the training is typically the last couple of weeks, you've seen like some pause work, some pin squats. We are now going full steam ahead as we're roughly about 11 weeks out from the next competition I'm doing. So we're trying to get more comp specific. So I'm actually going to be doing two main competition style squats. First session on Monday, second session on my third training day of the week, which is Thursday. Um, the top session for Monday is work up to a heavy single, which is predefined. So based off of a percentage work and then drop a certain percentage down and do some more volume based work. And things have actually been feeling pretty good. So top rep of 430 followed by back off sets of 400. Everything was moving pretty good. So can't really complain about that. From there, still doing bench three times per week. So again, the first, second, and fourth training days. On the first and fourth days, it's competition style. This particular day, it's more of rep work. So some sets of six or seven, I don't really know. To be honest, I'm not looking at what I'm doing necessarily in terms of what my program is right now. Uh, but 245, the bench has been feeling really well for me. So that caveat for me, my bench has always been a little bit of a struggle bus. It's been feeling pretty good. So fingers crossed that in the next 11, 10 weeks, things will really come to fruition. One of the things I'm also trying to do is really condense the time that I'm training because I don't have a lot of free time. So I'm supersetting some of this work. So on this particular day where I did bench, I also had a Romanian deadlifts. I actually did them from the floor, which typically you wouldn't do, but I was using the bench and I didn't want to have this set up while I was benching as well. So basically we do a set of bench, then a set of RDLs and back and forth and back and forth to kind of expedite some of this work. Um, but overall on this particular day, 255, this is my tempo day. So this is the only day I'm not doing a competition style movement in terms of everything. But to be honest, I like these a lot. Uh, it's really hard for me to count the tempo. It's a two second down, one second pause, and then just explode out of the hole. The problem is, is as I'm counting in my mind, I tend to kind of sometimes throw off my actual counting for the reps. So sometimes I'll do a little bit more or a little bit less. Uh, day three here, squatting some uh, volume sets with a little bit heavier weight from day one. So 440, things move really well. Wanted to get a little bit of a different angle. It's interesting how much an angle can change depth perception. These ones look a lot deeper than Monday, but I've been squatting long enough and consistently enough where my squats are always the same, but depending on how you look at them, they just look a lot different. Uh, deadlifts this particular day felt pretty good as as well. I'm really trying to make sure I load my hamstrings, deadlifts. I've been playing around with a lot of different things here. These might not look the prettiest, but they felt really good, which is great for me because the last couple of weeks, deads have been feeling pretty rough. I think part of that is the block pulls that I was doing on day two, which have now been switched out with the RDLs, which you saw, just kind of really tax me overall. And considering that I'm also squatting those twice per week also, it just left me kind of fizzled out on this day, which is Friday. But this particular day, I felt pretty good. So I was happy with that top set. And then even on top set of bench, it called for 270, but I didn't feel like loading all of the change plates. So I thought I'd just bump it up to 275 and this moved really, really well. I'm rating all of my last set RPE just to keep track of stuff and things are progressing pretty good. So looking forward to the next week. Hope you guys will have a good one. In the meantime, as always, thanks for watching and stay big.